Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. This is Frederick Cabanas, the head English teacher here at Mountain House English, Singapore. Today, I want to introduce you to Corona Time. It's going to be a special English vocabulary lesson that will help you today. So that way, you know coronavirus in your language, but maybe you're learning English in a Western country. So we don't want you confused. We, don't, we want you safe. So here's some vocabulary words for today's episode. The body. We have a beautiful picture of the body. And there's some important vocabulary words. The first one is the nasal cavity. That's the inside of your nose. Then we have what's called the pharynx. The pharynx is that space behind that little thing in the back of your mouth that goes ding, 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 ding. But that space has an opening called the larynx. And it travels through a tube called the trachea. The true, this tube enters the lungs, the big two organs that you always see in medical movies, where they go, bum, 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 right? Oh, that was the heart, bum, 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 bum. But the lungs go, Phew. And it's happening through this muscle called the diaphragm. But when air enters your lungs, it follows these big canals or tunnels. They're called bronchi. And these big tunnels become smaller tunnels or smaller tubes. They're called bronchioles. And they end at a point. And a point isn't really like a pencil point. It's more like a little balloon. And those little balloons are called alveoli. So this is today's vocabulary lesson. Please repeat after me. Nasal cavity. Pharynx. Larynx. Trachea. Lungs. Bronchi. Bronchioles. Alveoli. And diaphragm. I hope this was help helpful. Be safe and good evening.